Okay, we're, well, we pulled out the uh, wireless LAN card right there to give us a PCI Express slot inside the laptop. So that cable's plugged into that PCI Express sl slot that was made available by pulling that LAN card out of there. So here's the cable coming out the bottom of the laptop. Uh, as you can see, it's a little bubbled, buckled, I should say. I might cut a little bit of a slot to give some relief to that, but, I mean, it's down and it's snapped in. Probably not a big deal. Uh, but the cord runs all the way around here, and it plugs in, you can see right there, in the bottom of that adapter. Okay, so here is the video card. It's a PNY GTX 760 plugged into that adapter right there. A uh, lot of wires coming off this power supply, which is plugged into the wall. So coming back over to the laptop, plug the power back in here. Uh, oh, it's on the other side. Never mind. Let me flip it over here. And then we plug the power back in. Open it up. All right. So there's the power button right there. And when we turn it on, everything fires up out here as well. Just like when you would turn a desktop computer on, all the fans would start. So, and boom, this thing is already up. I just gotta put in the uh, my code, and we're up and going. And I don't know why that keeps coming up. Anyway, so come over here. Here, um, where is it? Yeah, this PC. I'm trying to do this while video, videoing it. Properties. Scroll down here to uh, device manager, and then uh, display adapter. Boom! There it is. Nvidia GeForce GTX 760. If I right click on that. Properties, this device is working properly. So everything's working. Old beat up laptop running a GTX 760. There's the video card. There's the graphics, or excuse me, the adapter card underneath. And then there's a power supply. So I'm going to have to zip tie all this together to make it a little neater. And then figure out a way to mount it all underneath the top shelf of the uh, AV cart where this laptop normally sets. So there you have it.